What's going on, y'all? I want to show you, which at least to me, is an easier way to get parts added to your Arranger track. Uh, Arranger track is a new feature in Studio One Three, and this is a mix uh, for Marco Dane that I'm starting on. And when I start my mixes, I like to place markers uh, for all the points in the songs, the verse hooks. Uh, and with the Arranger track, you can draw in those parts. So I tried doing the I tried setting those with the arranger track versus doing markers and it just took me a lot more time than I would normally spend if I just dropped markers. So I'm going to let's open up the open up the arranger track and the marker track and by holding command you can draw parts into into the arranger track intro verse chorus and then here's where things get a little weird to me because the next one is bridge and then you've got outro this isn't a, a typical song order um, at least for me but because there's you know normally another verse another chorus before the bridge so the way i found a, a quicker way at least for me to add to this arrange part let's delete these is to go through and drop my markers first like i normally do so let's let's go ahead and do that So once I got my marker set, we'll go ahead and I wish the markers would snap to the grid, but we'll just uh, make sure we got them all lined up. There we go. Now, if you right click on a marker, you've got the option to create arrange sections from markers. And by doing that now, I've got uh, the start, which is, should actually be the first hook. Just rename that here. Just call it first hook for now. We've got the first hook verse. Uh, second hook, verse two. This is actually verse or uh, hook three. But you get the point. But to me, that's a quicker way now of getting these parts into your arrange track and also getting them labeled the way that you want them. Um, you know, for me, I normally what is a chorus I consider a hook, so I normally would put hook instead of chorus. Uh, also, if you wanted to do this the other way around, you can. Uh, so if you wanted to create your arranger track first. Under the arranger, if you uh, right click, you've got an option to create markers from the arranger section. So this would do it in reverse in the way I do it. Uh, for me, it's quicker for me to drop the markers, name them, and then create the arranger parts for that. Uh, so there's a quick uh, tip for you. All right, I'll catch y'all next time.